There was no other decision they could make. He was not guilty. It was obvious to anyone watching the case uh, at all. I mean, if you saw the testimony, if you saw the, the closing arguments, if you saw the video, you know Rittenhouse was acting in self-defense. Any kind of conviction would have been an outrage, an absolute uh, injustice. So you're watching this, and maybe you're not happy because you think Rittenhouse is whatever, shouldn't have a gun. You're a gun control guy. Or maybe you you, you, you genuinely think that uh, it was an affront to BLM, whatever. But the ignorance from the critics, the ignorance from the angry left was beyond anything I expected. If you spend a minute, maybe two minutes, watching the video, you know he's innocent. You know it. There's really no debate. But they didn't care. They Okay. It was like a line was drawn. If you're on this side, you have to feign anger, ignor uh, indignation. You can't believe. And then you and you lie and you make you have all these canards about crossing state lines and, you know, having a weapon of war, a machine gun, as Geraldo Rivera said. First of all, he didn't cross state lines with the gun. But so what if he did? Secondly, this idea that he shouldn't have been there is totally irrelevant. <laughs>